Hi and welcome to Spice and Pants. December is the favorite month of the year for me. Why is that so? Because Christmas is here and I can cook a home feast for my family and friends. What do they like most? Meat dishes. The more, the merrier. For this Christmas, I'm making Asian style braised beef as well as Asian spice roasted lamb rack. I love to use Australian beef and lamb for these dishes. Why? The quality is always consistent and there's no compromise on taste. Plus, they offer great value. Here are the ingredients for the Asian style braised beef. The chuck gets more flavorful and tender as it cooks, and you can easily get this cut from supermarket and your local butcher. Cut the beef chuck tender into cubes and sear in a pan over high heat until they turn brown. When the beef is done, we'll remove it from heat and set it aside. We'll add in star anise, bay leaf and cinnamon bark. Next, we'll fry shallots, ginger and garlic until fragrant over medium heat. Next, we'll add in the beef and stir in to mix well. Then we'll add all the seasoning and also mix them up well together. We'll add enough hot water to cover the beef, followed by carrots and potatoes. If you're cooking this dish over a stove in a normal pot, put the lid on and bring the sauce to a boil over medium heat. Turn the heat to low and simmer for one to one and a half hours or until the beef is tender. Once the cooking is done, reduce the sauce over medium heat and thicken with some cornstarch solution. And this is Asian style braised beef. And next we'll have the Asian spice roasted lamb rack and here are the ingredients. Australian lambs are raised on pasture and they are naturally leaner. They have a mild taste and no gamey flavour. First, we'll score the fats on the lamb rack and tear the membrane off. Next, we'll blend all the seasoning into a paste and apply over the lamb rack. We'll leave the lamb rack to marinate in the fridge for at least 4 hours. Before roasting the lamb rack, we will need to heat up the oven to 220 degrees. Next, we'll drizzle some cooking oil over the baby potatoes and zucchini. Sort them lightly and mix them well. Next, we'll place the lamb rack on the roasting tray, followed by the baby potatoes, zucchini and cherry tomatoes. We will roast the dish for 20 to 25 minutes at 220 degrees Celsius depending on your desired doneness of the lamb rack. When the time is up, we will remove the dish from the oven, cover the lamb rack with an aluminum foil to let it rest for 10 minutes. This will ensure that the lamb rack remains juicy when you slice into it. And ladies and gentlemen, this is our Asian Spice Roasted Lamb Rack. And that's Christmas, the Spice and Pan style.